Welcome back. This video is going to go over how to upload and download configuration files from your edge switch. So what I've got here is I've got my lab edge switch 24 light and I'm running uh, edge OS 1.5 and you can see it's, it hasn't been up that long. I just upgraded the the operating system. I was on 1.3 so now we're on 1.5 and I just want to cover this um, I think it's important to know how to to make backup of your you know a backup of your configuration file so we're gonna go over to system and utilities and transfer and you can see now under file transfer you've got three different options for protocols you've got HTTP TFTP or FTP and then under each of those you have here is upload which is transfer a file to this device and then you have download which is transfer a file from the device so this is going to work similarly the upload and the download so if I want to download my current config I'm going to click the button under download and it's going to say what's the file type and uh, code is the operating system so if we go to startup config or backup config or even the factory defaults config we can download that. We can also download all the log files uh, and we can manipulate the CLI banner script files. This is very useful. Play around with this and 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 you know learn to figure this out. You can also do it over TFTP or FTP but I like using the the GUI, the GUI Ubiquity has probably, in my opinion, the best GUI in the industry. So, all right, so we're going to do an HTTP file download, and we're going to download the startup config. And we're going to say begin transfer. And it says transfer complete. And then you can see down here it says temp config script.scr. And that's it. And we can open this guy let's see let's try this again let's so you can see this is what the configuration looks like it's it's a it's a blank config at this point so up here you've got exclamation points you know this is uh, nothing that you're gonna mess with in the config so and what we could do is uh, we could we could save this to the desktop and we'll just say config to upload we'll save that and save it over to my desktop we'll come over here and we'll close this and let's say we want to upload that config or another config so we're going to upload a startup config, config to upload we're going to begin the transfer Transfer in progress, please wait. Progress, 100%. Close. So we just uploaded the new startup. So we can come over here to save config. We can do a copy. Uh, the uh, startup config. you could upload that to the backup configuration. And then your, for, your source file could be your backup config and you want to make it your startup config. So you could do it either way and then you reboot and you should be in good shape. So that's just a quick little primer on how to upload and download files from your edge switch uh, and we really concentrated on the configuration part of that so there are other things that you can upload if you look at this uh, you've got key files certificates factory D your users all kinds of stuff on the upload and all kinds of things on the download so play around with it you know see uh, see what you can and can't do if you like the video please give a thumbs up please subscribe Please comment and share, and we will see you at the next video.